Hey guys, Silent Oblivion 903 here once again. This is part 3 of my Outlast playthrough. Uh, as you saw in the last part, uh, I made my way through the prison block into the sewers, uh, which is where I am now. Uh, just before the end of the last part, uh, we saw a room filled with blood and uh, loads of nice guts and all that everywhere. And we thought, well, yeah, let, let's go have a look. Let's let's see what's going on in there. It obviously can't be that bad, you know what I mean? But, um, so yeah, that brings us down here. Uh, for obvious reasons, everyone else would go explore it, who wouldn't? But we did see a figure of someone, I believe, sort of in the light in the sewers. Uh, and I, I don't think he wants to play Blackjack. I'd, I'd love it if he'd play Blackjack. I, I could just sit all day and just do that. But I have a feeling he's going to do something pretty damn bad to me. So, with that in mind, I don't even know what I'm doing. There we go. I'm going to do it. Right, so the new objective is to flush the water by turning the two bowels. Right. Okay, okay. I'm assuming that is the vowels. Um, uh, where are we? Right, I'm assuming this is some sort of layout, obviously, of this area. Uh, I'm assuming we may be here. So, got a valve on the right, and then a valve on the left. Um, that is my best guess. Or it could be vice versa, we could be here, but I'd assume we are here. Right. Right, there is the dude. I believe he is just going to come towards me. I have no reason to suspect otherwise. Yep, he is coming towards me. Get me my camera. I'm just going to get back in here. Try and hide from him. Yep, he is coming right towards us. Right, it doesn't look like you can get through here. Right, this is going to be fun. Right, so he's gone left. Right, so I, I'm assuming my first. Uh, valve I'm going to do is the one on the right. I'm trying to be quiet. I don't. I, I don't know why I'm, why I'm trying to be quiet. I start like whispering a bit. Uh, like the in-game enemies is going to be like, oh shit, yeah, he's talking. I'm nowhere yet. You know what I mean? But anyway, right. It looks like we don't need. Like, it looks like I am somewhat coming the right way. Uh, going to close the door behind me. Anything around here could do with a couple of batteries. To tell you the truth, there is one there, coincidentally. Right, there's some lockers there, should be able to hide. Right, I'm going to drain the water. Uh, that was fairly straightforward. Get the camera up, what am I doing? Right, I'm going to hide in here because, um, in true video game fashion, I'm assuming he is going to break through this door. Obviously, he's, he's, he's on the warpath. Uh, just going to hang out here just momentarily and just see what happens. If he doesn't break out uh, into this room, then I'll carry on. But uh, they've played enough horror games in my time to know what to expect. Or is it going to be a uh, sort of the opposite? Do you expect this to happen? It's not going to happen. But uh, time will tell. Get a little bit impatient here. Right, he's either going to break through the door or he isn't. I don't know how long I'm supposed to wait. I just really... There... Oh, right. There we go. Right. Please don't find me. Um, I noticed in earlier parts that they only generally tend to look in one locker, so that might be good for me. Please turn. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Ah, ah, shit. I'll look at my gun. I'll look at my gun. Ah, shit. Wait, no. I don't have a gun. Ah, I'm the fucking jackass. I didn't fucking bring one. Ah, run. I'm pressing run. Fucking run. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Who the fuck doesn't bring a gun to an asylum? Fuck it. Right. He's gone left again. Right, this is fantastic. Right. Obviously, that is where I want to be. 
I don't know whether there's some sort of path that's going to curve round that obviously if he walks down that'll give me an open access to where I need to be. Obviously it looks like it from the map. It looks like obviously the you can follow the yellow line on the which is like the valve, the pipe. Uh, obviously it looks like there is two paths, so hopefully he goes down one and that should give me access to the other one freely. No, he's there. He's there as you can see. Right, looks like he's gone to the right, which provided he doesn't. S oh shit! Right, go through here. Go through here. Please don't be that far behind me. Right. Go through here quick. Right, I think I, I think I'm okay. Right. <sighs> that did that, that sort of went a plan actually. Uh, not when I was expecting it to go a little bit easier than that. Uh, I didn't actually know he was going to go right. That was uh, quite coincidental. I was sort of just biding my time trying to figure out what to do next really. Uh, and that, that was quite lucky. I was expecting to run into him either way. Looks like there's a battery here. Right. Use the ladder to access the Lord Junction. I'm assuming uh, that is where the water's drained. Right, so I'm going to use this again. Right, I have no idea where he is though. There he is. Right, I'm just going to hide out here. And let's see which way he goes. If you could turn back right, that would be fantastic. No, he's going to go the way I need to be. Right, that is, that's, that's good also. That, that is good. Right, I'm just going to let him go across there where he went the first time, where the first valve was. And then that should give us a bit more of a easy access. I hope. But yeah, I'm just gonna run. But I'm gonna run back to that uh, point just down here where he can't get us. Oh shit, it's close, close. Shit, get, get back. <laughs> right, there we go. The safety. You can't get us, fuckhead. Yeah, you better run, bitch. Ugly motherfucker. Right. Trash talking is key. Right, um. Right, this looks like where we need to go next. Climbing down this ladder. Right, looks like we're at the bottom now. Yes, it uh, looks like we're lower down in the sewers. Is that a body? No, no. Right, yep, I suspected it's absolutely pitch black. I can go over here. No. Right, it's going to go down this way. Uh, the battery's getting low. It's going to reload the batteries. Oh shit. Right, I'm just gonna make my way over here. Right, there's another ladder. Oh shit, shit, it was. Fuck. Please do not be sanded above me when I get up here. Ah, oh, I cannot be done with your shit. Is he there? Oh, where'd he go? Right, find a way out the sewers. Um, I, I thought that's what I was I was doing. Uh, that I was, I thought, oh, well, we just set, having a little leisurely stroll. Right, the admin block. 
I'm assuming this is the way out of the sewers. Right, it looks like this is just a narrow path, uh, obviously with no doors. At least I know nothing's popping out yet. Oh shit, what's that? Shit, get in here. Close this door. Who's that dude? The doctor's dead, you know that, right? Dr. Barricade died before he even started working here. What kind of experiments does a dead doctor perform on living patients? That's the question. Right, let's have a look down here. Right, looks like we are back in the sewers. Uh, that's that's a promising sign. Right, male ward, female ward. Um, my personal preference would be the female ward. Uh, or am I just going to go get your oh shit? All right, that could explain the blood. Someone? No, but I didn't need my night vision. I thought I saw someone down there. Right, just got to make my way through here. Oh, please don't have anyone. Shit. I think I just heard something. Where did I not? Can I go through here? No. So I was going the right way anyway. God, I think I was just making things up there, just imagining uh, someone behind me. But with this game, you never know. Right. Still pitch black. Left or right? We'll go right this time. Did the screen just shake. I'm feeling there's someone. Right, something's going to come and fuck me up very, very soon. I just have a feeling. Right, I'm just going to make my way through here. Um, no idea where I'm going. I'm sure it'll become clear. Unless this wasn't even the way to go. Yeah, it looks like there's no gap there, so I'm assuming I'm going to have to go back out this way. It'd help if I could actually see something. Right, I think this is actually the way I need to go. I'm just going to reload my batteries. Right, this would not be the best place for one of those lunatics to pop out. So, um, I, I have a feeling one's pro probably going to appear somewhere. Uh, that's just the nature of this game. Right, looks like I'm actually out. Was I crouching the whole time there? Or maybe why I was going so slow. Oh well, anyway. Oh shit, still pitch black. Best keep his night vision on. Is he going to wake up? No, thank god. Okay, back in the water. Um, probably the last place I wanted to be. Should I see something there? Right, 
Is this just blocked up? No, there's a hole in here. It's going to go through. But it's still uh, dark. Is there reasons like vision doesn't really appear to be working very well? Is that that's just to put the uh, jitters up me even more? I've got to say, the quality of this night vision is pretty poor at the minute. Can't do anything with this foul. Doesn't look like it. Like, I literally, I might as well just be in the dark. I literally can't see a thing. I'm just running. I have no idea where it is I'm running to. I'm just going straight as far as I can tell. I believe I've steered off. I think I've got to the end here. Yeah, I could literally just wander around forever trying to find my way. I'm probably in the back where I started. If there's a battery. Oh, handy, I'm sure. Oh, shit! I'm going to run towards here. I believe this may have been the way I came, but I don't give a fuck at this moment in time. Just get me the fuck away from him. Oh, shit! Shit, shit, shit! Fucking up! Get up! Oh, fuck's sake. Why wouldn't he get up? Oh, fuck. I knew something else was going to happen. Right. Right. I can do it again. Right, so there's a dude somewhere in here and I have somewhere I need to be and I don't know where that is that is great right, this is where I got the battery I believe no it wasn't Is that where I started? I believe it is. Right. I said for night vision, this absolutely sucks. I said it out if I actually knew where fuck I was going. Oh shit, do I not want to do that? Right, so now I think I'm just sort of skimming around the outside of the room. See, I can't even get up there. Why do I keep doing that? Right, so yeah, there's literally nothing around here. Except those boxes. I just saw something there. No, was it just, was it just water dripping?
Right. Not a clue where I'm going. I just know there is a big fucker in this room with me. And I don't really like it. Right, let's carry on. I'm just going to sort of make my way up here. Maybe just get a bit of a feel for the size of the room. And then there might be an exit somewhere. Because I believe he was on the opposite side of the room. Right, so we're about centre. Uh, pretty much. In the room now. Is there a light? What's this? Right, it looks like some kind of broken stairway. And is this where we need to be? Looks like it. Right. Okay. There we go, on the ladder. Oh, that was luck. That really was luck. I did not have a clue where I was going there. I think we're safe. I don't think he'll be falling. I don't think he actually saw us at all. Um, which is fantastic. Just going to close that to be on the safe side. Oh shit! Shit! Oh, as what? As a bitch? What? A dick? I can't believe that dude got up. He sat there with his head in his arms, pretending like he's a lunatic, and we walk through the door, and he just goes, "Fuck you, fuck you, mate." Right, so will we be in Chester? I'm not totally sure. Probably, it's more than likely. More than likely, there's going to be some son of a bitch who's going to pop out of nowhere. There's a dude on the opposite. I don't even know which side he's on now, but he can just stay away from me. Right, it looks like we're sort of back in the sewers again now. Uh, with a nice trail of blood. We're going to run through here. Right, there's a dude running away. Okie dokie. Um, with the way this game is, you can quite easily just turn around now and just turn on me. Uh, it's going to be a about here somewhere. Right, there's a crack in the wall, right? That's always handy. The enemies can't get through the cracks uh, from what I've gathered. So that's always a good thing. Right, is there anything down here? Just a lot of dead bodies. Nice. Yeah. Right, so it looks like we've got to go up the stairs here. Like so. Right. Reach the ground floor of the male ward. Is our next objective. I can remove this out of where yet. Yeah. Oh, who's that there? I'm just going to have a look through here. Alright, there's the dude in a straight jacket with a lot of blood around him. Um, 
Obviously, something bad's probably going to happen. But I am going to leave that for the next part. Uh, perfect time to stop there. Just uh, I say, I know something's going to happen very, very soon. So well, I don't know. I just predict it will. So I'm just going to leave it there. Um, that concludes part three. And a nice long part. A lot of uh, shit scary moments there for us. A uh, lot to take in. But thanks for watching. And I hope you'll join me in part four. Very, very soon. Right, I'm going to need a little break actually to get my bearings back. Uh, it's been a bit of a tense moment. But like I said, anyway, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys very, very soon. Until then, bye for now.